Hi, Flosstube. Hi, Flosstube. I'm Chris. I'm Jane. And we are the Floss Stitchers. Thanks for joining us today. Today is episode 81, and it's January 15th. Yes. Happy yeah. Martin Luther King Day mm -hmm. to everyone. Yes. Uh, you had to work today. I did have to work. But I yes. didn't. No. I didn't. No. So that's I why hope I... most of you have the day off. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, <laughs> we're filming a little bit earlier today. So. Uh, so we're even fresher. Yeah. <laughs> that's right. That's right. Um, so I just have to tell you a, a quick story. So I was, um, you know, at... Um, not working today, so uh, wearing a sweatshirt. I'm wearing my 98.5, the Sports Hub sweatshirt today. And as I was about to leave, my husband says, oh, so you're promoting 98.5 today, huh? I said, yeah, I guess so. And he said, uh, don't forget to tell everybody that they can listen on the app. So... <laughs> So. There's a lot to talk about in Boston sports this week. There certainly there? is. Yes, there is. So, yeah. yeah. So you want to tune in. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, so let's see. What did we? Oh, we went to. Well, you've been. You've gone stitching twice. I did. I, I had a good once. week. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we had a nice day together at the World of Stitches, mm -hmm. Mandy Shop. I had been there for. Probably before Thanksgiving. Right. So, I only have you even yeah. been there since the farm? Probably not. No. Yeah. 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 Because the holidays and everything, my my schedule, I, I usually uh, have my um, great niece, kind of like every other weekend, and with the holidays and everything, that kind of got messed up. Uh, now I'm hoping that I'll be back to more of a regular <laughs> a schedule. Regular stitching schedule. Oh, that's right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But that was fun. It was really fun to to see everybody. We had a really good group. Yeah, we did. Um, Randy and Shop are doing well. <laughs> and so and you went to you also went, I went to Stitch, to New, Stitch England. New England. Pam Shop and North Pam Pam and Shop are doing well. And had a great time there too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That mm -hmm. was bustling as well. Yeah. 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 Um, so we're going to do things a little out of order today because <laughs> da, 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 fanfare, uh, Chris is going to do a whip parade. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Jane thought it couldn't be done. But <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, first we're going to start off with some, uh, random acts of kindness and then um, I'm going to do my whips. I have a finish. And then we're going to jump into Chris's whip parade. All right. Um, so grab a Dunkin' Donuts <laughs> coffee or the right. courtesy of Jane or right. your beverage of choice. <laughs> All right. So when you went to Stitch New England. Yes. You saw nice. our friend Stephanie. The New England Stitcher, mm -hmm. and she does beautiful, um, would you call this woodwork? Yeah. Okay, woodwork. Yeah. Yeah, yeah she makes beautiful items, mm -hmm. and she made us these terrific personalized mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. floss do you call them floss measures, or is there a I don't know if there's a, a special name? term, but okay. yeah. All right. But that's what we're calling them. Yeah, I've been we wanting. Love it. I've been wanting one of these. Me so, too. Yeah. So this is great. This is great. It's got all she the um, lovely job. It's got on all this. the Boston sports teams. Yeah. The ma four major Boston sports Boston teams, teams on it. Yeah. Boston skyline, mm -hmm. and not just that. But if that wasn't enough, we have uh, needle minders that she made us, and the um, needle minder is on. Uh, her own personalized okay. floss cards. This is uh, the New England Stitcher. And if you haven't and... watched her on floss tube yet, oh, you yeah. should be. Yep, yep. She's just she's a new floss tuber, and you should definitely check her out. Um, she is she's very also, prolific. That's I don't know if people are going to be able to read that or not, but she's also on um, Instagram as uh, the New England Stitcher. Um, underscore between every word. So, um, the New England Stitcher, yeah. 
So, so thanks, uh, Stephanie. Yeah, thank you so much. That was we that look was, forward to seeing you again. That was such a nice surprise. <laughs> All right. Um, I, oh, uh, Jane, would you care <laughs> to throw out the first stitch? I would. All right. Wow. I haven't said that in so long. Uh, I know. <laughs> you're out of, you're out of practice. Okay. Um, so, let's see. My, um, my bag that Tracy, uh, my friend from OG Citri, gave me. So cute. And... Um, I am doing the, um, the Mill Hill, uh, Buttons and Beads Christmas Village. Um, I want to do the set, but I'm starting off with the, <laughs> the tree farm. So. Good place to start. Yeah. So here we go. Actually, the reason I picked it and, uh, was because this is, um, from 2006. This is the first one in the series. Oh, all right. So, anyway. <laughs> Yeah. Well, uh, uh, how's that work? Are there like a few every year they release? Would um, you say? I think there's. I want to say there's one or two. Well, yeah, okay. it's probably one or two every year. All right, doing a quick, little quick math. <laughs> two thousand six, mm -hmm. two thousand twenty-four. Yeah, so, yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. you're gonna be busy for a while. There's a lot. Yeah, there's a lot. And that I, looks and lovely. Have though. A lot. So here we go. You have quite a few beads on that by I now. Do. Yeah. Um, a lot of the blank space uh, over here, anyway, uh, will be filled in with beads. I still have some stitching to do over here, but um, I was getting a little confused between the um, the stitches and yeah. the beads. And um, somebody was telling me that kind of a good rule of thumb is that the symbols on the um, on the chart, if they're round, then they're more of a bead, or they may be a bead. I remember you so, saying that. In, yeah, you're correct. Yeah, yeah. Um, so I was getting myself a little confused. Anyway, I decided that I would start doing some beading over here to kind of fill it in and and uh, help me keep track of of where I'm going. So, um, our friend Mary Ellen, who was at. Um, Stitch New England this past week. Yeah. She is doing her first Mill Hill now. Uh-huh. And she said, um, I know you're supposed to do the stitching first, mm -hmm. but I wanted to see yeah. like what the beads <laughs> are gonna be like. Yeah. Almost I've been kind of like a how bad is it gonna be kind of thing. Yeah. So she started putting in on the areas that she's stitching. Just looks great. Yeah. Just really makes it come alive. I wish I could remember the name of the chart she's doing but you know it if you saw it it was like a winter scene okay you know a couple of birds and, yeah yeah and uh i'm going to try this year to really participate on mill hill monday um so today's monday so <laughs> tonight I'll, i will be stitching. you've got your assignment i will be stitching on this and actually that's my first mill hill kit too oh is it really yeah, yeah. okay yeah all right next um, this is my snow day project. We did have a little bit of snow, and so I started this. This is uh, a Glendon place. It's called New Snow, and the picture fell off, but here we go. <laughs> oh, so it's vintage then. It is vintage. Real picture. Yes. Uh-huh. And uh, the call for fabric is, picture this plus uh, jazz, and that is the fabric that I'm doing it on. And I will, let me just take this off really It's not too much quick. trouble for you, is it? poor hands taking this off the Q-snap. But I started with the, I started with the tree. And uh, there's a lot of, um, uh, well, I guess, I'm not sure what the, uh, what the name of the floss is that you're, that it calls for. It's probably like. Oh, that glisten gloss? It, yeah, glisten something? gloss, but it, it's something that. The chart's so old that you can't get it anymore. Oh, yeah. So yeah, I'm using uh, Petite Treasure Braid PB10, which is, um, which I looked it up and they said that that's the one that you should be using. So, or that you could use. So that's what I'm doing. Nice. All right. Let me take care of that one. Let me just put this over here. All right. And then in my Studio 88 West bag, that I got um, the fabric when I went to Alaska and asked 
the shop owner to make me a bag. Um, uh, this project is Let Freedom Ring. Yay! My Leela's studio. <laughs> Uh, this one, I would really, uh, I'm, I'm going to try this year to do at least a half an hour of stitching on this um, daily. And Is that going I, well so far? You know, I've been, yes, okay. um, but I've been actually stitching on it even more than an hour because I'm really having kind of, I'm having a good time with it. And so, you know we all want to see this. All right, so you completion. can hold that. All right, so or no? Uh, no. All right, so here is where I am, and I was working down in this bottom corner, and then I got kind of bored. <laughs> so I and the top flowers, I decided that those needed to be done. So I started working up on the left hand side with the flowers this week. Um, this middle part uh, of um, this, uh, it says Independence Hall, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, United States, 1732 to 1753, that the words are all over one. I know, it looks like it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I, I had the first two lines done and, and I just thought, oh, I gotta, I just gotta finish that. So I did that and then I did the flag and the flag is almost done. Um, you just have mostly just the white, I think, and then there's another one more red stripe in there. So I'm, having, I'm having fun with this. And now that it's off yeah, the Q okay. snap, I might go back down to the corner and really Finish try to up. really try to come just complete. Yeah. Um, because the chart is. I had to put the chart, like I taped it together. Oh, yeah. So the it's chart so is like really thick. Um, and I'm, I just want to take the, um, I don't know, I made a working copy. So I just want to undo you that need, and shred it. I need to tell you, know? you this, but you have so much done. I know. I know. You really just got like. Mm -hmm. A little bit here, mm -hmm. just a tan, mm -hmm. and then this. Yeah, yeah. I know. I can finish it this year, I think. Oh, definitely. Yeah. Without oh. a doubt. Then I have to figure out what my next half uh, <laughs> half hour project of the day would be. Oh yeah, I bet you got a few candidates. <laughs> All right, and then um, this is uh, a portfolio. Um, another um, Studio 88 West creation. I know, I just saw that she put some um, Ooh, new ones in oh. her um, shop. So Run. go check them Don't. out. Yeah. Whoops. Whoops. Um, and they come with, uh, so some of them, they're all a little bit different, but this one has um, place for bobbins, has a couple. That of, is a deluxe uh, one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Has um, a couple terrific. of. Um, little pockets here, there's a pocket back here, and then you can slide in your your projects. All right, this one, excuse me, yeah, I just can you get that? this, yes. This project is one of my smalls that I'm doing. I'm going to do 24 smalls in 2024. And this is a, a barefoot needle art. It is called it's a cute one. Cardinal Way. Um, I just realized that I haven't been telling you, I didn't tell you what I did, the um, uh, Let Freedom Ring. That's 36 count linen, pampas grass for, by Seraphim. All of it will be in the description box. Anyway, this is Cardinal Way. And I remember everybody buying that at Celebration Slash. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I'm doing this on a 36 count... Um, Petty Point, uh, so um, I think that's just the name of it, right? I think so. And this is gray. Uh, and so this is what I worked on at Stitch, um, I mean, uh, The World in Stitches. So I did a lot of, I finished this bottom part of the pole, put in some of the white. The, all of this down here is filled in with white. Um, and then up here is um so i'll just go up here and then the top of the the, pole, the light pole so this is coming along pretty yeah, well yeah that will go quick um so i may but i may start my second um 
small before I finish this one just because it's almost halfway through the month. Okay. And that's going to be, um, I decided it's going to be Let Her Snow. So. Oh, nice. All right. Um, so the next thing I want to talk about is I should have another uh, whip to show you, but I don't because uh, Lynette and um, Homesteading on the Home Front and Amy Gable Stitcher are doing an Elsa Williams kit. And the kit that they're doing is, um, I think it's called Sunday Morning Memories. And when I saw that they were starting that, I was like, oh yeah, I have that. I'll, you know, I'll just, I'm going to join in. And when I went to pull out uh, the kit that I have, um, I realized that it is not Sunday morning <laughs> memories. Mine is once upon a winter day. So there are three of the same sort of bell pulls. And one is the Sunday morning memories. And the other one is this one. And this is once upon a winter day. And the reason um, I figured this out was because Lynette has, Lynette is going gangbusters oh, on hers. She is incredible. I think she yeah. posted again today. Yeah, yeah. So, um, <laughs> and up at the top here is a church. And I'm looking at this and I'm going, wait a minute, where's the church on this? <laughs> no church. That's when I realized that this is not the same one. And what I, and I'm a big Elsa Williams fan. So I have a lot of Elsa Williams <laughs> kits. And I can't believe I didn't have that I one. Know. And I, I'm thinking I probably saw it and thought, oh, Yo, we I got that. This. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> because the other one that I have um, is the general store bell pull, and this is the one that the three of us are going to do after Sunday morning memories. So I have that one ready to go. So I had I to buy. Are, well, you did go shopping. I did go shopping. Yeah, okay. I bought Sunday morning memories. Uh, it is not here yet. Um, you have to buy these on um, on a secondary market. Um, I'm just hoping that Lynette doesn't have hers finished before I start <laughs> mine. <laughs> so. I, I hope you paid for expediting. Yeah. <laughs> <You're> right. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, ladies, you gonna do ladies, you, you're going to have to get uh, once once upon <laughs> a winter day. So that we can all have three panels. Um, so it depends on what um, it depends on what the stitch count is. Okay, because the the general store bell pull is longer than once oh. upon a winter day. So once upon a winter day, I was going to do on 32. This one I was going to do on 36 so that hopefully when they're done, they can come up Pretty, almost yeah. the same size. And I don't know what the stitch count is on. Um, yeah. Yeah. They all come with like a 14 count Ada. Right. So well, so they I'll are from that back out. in the day. They are from back in the day. <laughs> yep. All right, so that takes care of my okay. whips and um And someone I'm has not, a finish? Mm, yes. I'm not gonna show any haul because we have plenty to do today. <laughs> so plenty to talk about. Yeah. Um so I wanted to do a uh twelve days of Christmas um project and I decided to do Wise Men by Erica Michaels. And here is the chart. So I started this on Christmas Day, which is the first day of Christmas, and I finished it on the 11th day wow. of Christmas. You do want the board. I do. Do we All have right, one? We do. Okay. Oh, nice. Okay. And here it is. Right. And I did not do this on the... Um, Call for call for, oh no, because the call for <laughs> the call for is the uh, silk gauze, the forty count silk gauze, one well, over I'm one, on that. which I didn't do. This is a twenty eight count, just navy from uh, it says Weigart fabric, and uh, I did not use the call for. I mean, if I had it, I used it. Um, Gentle Art Gold Leaf. I didn't have Grecian Gold, so I substituted that. Peach ice cream from um, the general art I had, um, and 
Otherwise, I substituted with some coloring cotton. And if you want to know what they were, you can just message us and I will get that out for you. This bottom part um, on the chart is it was all filled in with purple, but I decided not to and just leave that as is. And I like it. I, I love pretty that. Good. Definitely pops on there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, it came out really good. Yeah, very that's happy nice. with that. Uh, what are you thinking on for a finish for that? Are you gonna frame it? Or? Probably. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I think it's I think it's big enough right. so that a flat fold might be too big. Yeah. So, yeah. Um. All right, and that's that. Now. All right. Well, Jane has for the main event. Jane has a big assignment here because I've got them in order. Okay, here we go. On the list and on the box. So All right. We'll so, dig in. Mm -hmm. And, you know, as I was going through and I was writing the information on them, you know, a uh, number of them are kits, a um, number of them uh, are not kits, so I chose the fabric for them. And I found myself over and over again in writing, called for colors, called for colors. Mm. So just assume the floss was the call for. Yeah. Is that, I typically do that and I typically don't use the call for fabric. So I'll let you know what that is. Mm -hmm. So, and these aren't in any particular order other than the order in which I found them. <laughs> so we're going back in time. <laughs> And this is a Design Works kit, Happy Hour. And I believe the only thing that I have left on that, is there a little picture in there or maybe there isn't even? No, no picture. All right. Well, well oh, yeah, yeah, here it is. Here it is. Yep. Well, if you have really good eyesight, there's like little, where the olives would be, like in the martini glass, there's like, little sequins that go on that. And like, other than that, maybe a little bit of beading. Mm -hmm. I think that's it. So, you know, of course the question is, why didn't I ever go back and finish it? But that's, that's number really, one. That's cute. Yeah, it is it cute. It is cute. Yeah. All right, so. All right, so number one. When, when is this slated for finish? Well, I have 29 whips here, I think. Okay. There were a couple others that I couldn't quite put my hands on. So okay. we're going with about 29. Mm -hmm. And when I went through them all at the end, thinking like, you know, what could I realistically finish of these this year? Mm -hmm. I kind of came up with like about 17 of them, I think I could. Wow. So I thought right. if I could finish 15 of them this year, mm -hmm. wow. I'll be happy. Okay. So we'll exactly. see how that goes. All right. Okay, not a heck of a lot to show on this. And yet this is one that um, mm -hmm. has been on my boss. I put on my boss feet board, mm -hmm. I think maybe three times at least. I love Sir Thomas from mm -hmm. the moment I laid eyes <laughs> on it years ago. So I finally purchased it. And then, of course, I haven't done that much on it. And I didn't just purchase this. I bought like the whole kit and boodle from... Mm -hmm. um, uh, Glenn in place, which had great customer service, by the way. And so this is what I have so far. But um, I do intend to work on this a lot this year. Whether this will be one of the finishes, I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. I'd love to have it for Thanksgiving. We'll see how that goes. Um, lots of specialty flosses, beads, etc. in this one. It is really beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. So again, there's the packet. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> wow. I think that's the first. Can I see this one even. too? Yeah. Oh yeah. I think it keeps going. Oh yeah. And it's yeah. all floss. Nice. Yep. Yeah. Some oh. more. Fantastic. <laughs> all right. Yeah. Well, you yeah. don't have to go anywhere though to no, get it. It's all right on. here. And this was the called for fabric, which I believe is 28 count China Pearl Lugana. Mm -hmm. Nice. Yeah. So, either way, I hope I make some yeah. good progress on that. Mm -hmm. Oh, this next one's going to look familiar to Jane, too. <laughs> you, you, you maybe actually beat me on this one, did you? This is Needle Bling. 
Tom the turkey. Did oh, you? Ever I didn't one? start it. I oh, all right. It. Well, I guess I beat you then. Yeah. This was a whole kit that we bought at Galamia, right? Yeah. And okay, with the feathers and everything. Yeah. <laughs> there is not a heck of a lot to see. I might need my notes on this one. Did I know oh. what that fabric was or not? Oh, this is 36 count Swigert Inboro linen mm -hmm. in country mocha. Mm. So as you can tell, it's not a big. Where did I put that? Oh, right here. Yep. Not a big design, but yeah. not a lot of stitching to it. You're just doing the <laughs> eyes. But I don't eyes, nose, and have a lot of that done. Yeah. Yeah. Hope the feathers are still in here. Huh? Oh, they are. Yeah. There you go. They are. Yeah. yeah. It's a kit, so you got the backing fabric and all of that, That's right? That's right. So. Yeah. To pass right along to our finisher. Uh huh. Exactly. So, <laughs> could be finished this year. Yeah, it could be. Could be one of those. All right. Are we, we uh, have you, um, uh, um, are you are you going to separate out the seventeen? That you no, have, I think I'm just gonna stuff? yeah okay. yeah. All right. Um, next we have you know, and actually the other part of this that I love is that I get a chance to show mm. some of these beautiful bags and mm -hmm. not yeah seen the light of filming anyway for quite a while. This is That's a good one. This is such a great one, mm -hmm. which our friend Tracy OG Stitchery made. And this is a little Mill Hill kit. Hello, Autumn. Uh, I got that much. I got the whoops. Kind of too much glare. I think that's okay. All right. I think they just. Oh. Yeah. Oh, you're right. You're right. Yeah, as usual. As usual. <laughs> oh, make note of that, okay? <laughs> Hello, Autumn. There we go. Cute. Hey, you know. Cute. I didn't realize. Yes. I guess I have number 30 in here. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Okay, I do have another little mill hill in here. This is bacon and eggs. Mm. And this actually goes with a, another whip we'll see down the road here. And... That is um, Jane and, and I, my Porktober uh, yep. uh, sale. And I thought, well, when I get that done, I'm going to, I'm going to, um, yeah, put that on the uh -huh. frame yeah. of that. Mm -hmm. so, That's a good thought. Yeah. Okay. So who knew? Yeah. It's another one. All right, pass that along. Mm -hmm. Oh, here is one that I just love, but I have not made any progress on since I think uh, the farm in November of twenty-two. Okay, it's the only time I worked on this. Mm. Certainly, will look familiar to many people. Oh, on yeah. the street. Everybody, a lot, live of people, on little. a lot of people started that at the farm. Yeah, yeah. A lot of people probably have finished it since then. <laughs> and other people don't like this a saying on it. How great the blessing and vast the art to live on little with a thankful heart. But I do like that saying. Because as I've said before, it reminds me of my Aunt Claire. Because mm. that's the way that she lived. Mm -hmm. But... Um, I have not, nice. as you see, mm -hmm. got too much done on it. Mm -hmm. This is a one. Nice I, piece of fabric. Yeah, that is, uh, that's 32 count Belfast natural mm -hmm. linen. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, nice. And uh, don't expect to have a finish on that this year, but I would like to make some significant progress. Oh, I did bring the boss me board along, and uh, that's one that I think got its own. Uh, square on here mm -hmm. so i will touch it at least once this year more than that though i hope 
Oh, Jane's going to love this one. <laughs> All right, Jane. This yeah. is one of the 17. <laughs> this is yes. Mill Hill Pomegranate. Uh huh. This has looked like this for years now, hasn't it? <laughs> yes. It and has. I love this. Yeah. And I just need to, to get it. those beads out yep. and to finish this thing. Yep. Do you have the beads? Yeah. Um, I have some of them here, <laughs> okay. but I also have a dish of them, which okay. has been like that okay. in my craft room, so to mm -hmm. speak. You've even started some of the beads right there. I know. Yeah. Look at all those holes. Yeah. And all you got to do is not that. I know. Okay, good. Yeah. All right. I don't know what's wrong with me on that one. This will be the There's year. There's nothing wrong with you. This will be the year. <laughs> this will be the year. Okay. All right. Uh, let's see. We've got Brenda Gervais next. Be thankful. This is also one that I'm sure I was dying to get it. I oh, yeah. I've done. That's a nice one. Plenty that was a foul, wasn't on it? it. With yes. doing it with a few people, mm, you know that you remind me. I think so. <laughs> uh -huh. That's what I've got on it. Look, you've got the whole top border done. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> or is that the bottom it's a border? Start. <laughs> uh, I'll have to go back and look before I start stitching again. That's on. Oh, that's an unknown linen, but I love that. Yeah, it's pretty. I love that. It's uh, really pretty. Whoops. Let's do it this material. Way. Yeah, it's really pretty. Yeah. Nice. And I'm pretty sure that's all kitted up there. So, yep. with a lot of special glosses. So, okay, this is a fun one. And this one is under the category of I just need to finish this. <laughs> <laughs> this is a My Big Toe design. And. Oh, you have that other one that you already have hanging that um, the deeds. Oh, well, that's, that's right. Yes. Yeah. 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 Um, this is In My Defense. Oh, yeah. I love this. I do, too. <laughs> in My Defense, I was left unsupervised. Yeah. <laughs> and this is on 28-count Valor uh, Cashel Linen. Nice. This, this, yeah. I can finish this. Yeah. It's all words. Yeah. 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 All right. Okay. Oh, <laughs> this also falls under the category of, I don't know why I haven't finished this before. <laughs> this was a kit from Lindy Stitchers a number of years ago. Do you have a picture there? Yep. Yeah, Lindy good. Stitches. Good, because you'll probably need a picture to figure <laughs> this out. Let us rejoice <laughs> and eat cake. <laughs> <laughs> Everything is there, you know, the backing, yeah. the oh, yeah. material. Right, there we go. Absolutely everything. Okay. So. Mm. Yeah, this is a, that's a cute one. Yeah. yeah. No cause not to have that one then. Okay. Uh, this is one. I think I bought at um, Town Ho when I was at the Cape one summer. Mm. And I started it right away. Town Ho is a great shop. It is. It is a fun place. Bre Brewster? Yes. Yeah. 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 And there's some old treasures and then, uh, like, not a whole lot of new stuff, but um, Mill Hill is one that he tends to have a lot of Amirabilia's, a few lines. Cricket collection. Cricket collection, Yeah. Mm. Um, so I was really taken with Santa's clothesline mm -hmm. and, you know, I got started on it and then I seemed to immediately lose interest on it, but eh, not a heck of a lot done on this, but it's not like it would be mm. a heck of a lot of stitching either. I think, I don't think this is one that, you, oh yeah, you know what, let me take that back. I think this is, you do fill in, it's full coverage. You oh. fill in that. Oh, with the light yeah. green? Yeah. Wow. Okay. All right. This one just went from doable so <laughs> to maybe not. Well, 
<laughs> but but do you really have to? That's the other yeah. question. Yeah, do you I really you have to do the look, background? Look, I've done some of it. I've done a good portion of it actually. The background? Oh, yeah. that's, oh, it's that. Yeah. Oh, I thought that that was like a. Oh, I see. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, that's a full coverage. Yeah, sure okay. is. Mm -hmm. All right, maybe put that back down to uh, 16 I could get done this year. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, I love this one. This is on my list of absolutely need to do this this year and it's on my boss me board this is ink circles quaker genetics mm. and i really don't know why this one didn't get more love last year because it's one i really wanted to do my daughter i don't know if she'd be as enthused about it as i am but <laughs> I just love it, and mm. I, I, I love everything about this. I love ink circles, anyway. But I love the colors, and I love this fabric, which is uh, 28 count violet, wood violet jobelin. Mm. I love that. Yeah, I love working on jobelin, and I love mm -hmm. the color. And mm. So this is one you'll see this year. Okay. Is it on your boss me? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's on there, and it's like, it's got its own um, one, and then it comes, like, under different categories, like uh, Five Days on a Manny Project. Oh, or, yeah. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. Something that I could actually finish this year. Okay. So. All right. Mm. Oh. You have a lot yes. of mill hills. I have so many <laughs> mill hills. <laughs> I think this also probably came from um, um, Town Hall. Uh -huh. And it probably also fell into the vacation category. Of, I mean, this was one I think I probably, you know, gazed at. I think you've looked at that for a long at time. Silver Needle when we've seen them at Galleria. Um, Inspired Needle. <laughs> Oh, no, Silver Needle. Yeah, right. yeah. Mm -hmm. And um, very excited to start it, but that... <laughs> there we go. That wore out pretty fast, didn't there it? There we go. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, I, like Jane, I am planning on doing Mill Hill Mondays. <laughs> I did it last week, and it was so fun. Plus, mm -hmm. I did it... I had um, Mill Hill... Five days of a Mill Hill on my... Um, uh, that was Boston called for board. January? Yeah. Okay. All right. I'll, Good. I'll leave this to you to figure out, Jane. Sure. And um, so I kept working on it five days straight. Yeah. And just loved it. I'm going to pick it up again later today. You'll see that at the end. So, um, yeah, I'm excited to get back to those this year. Oh, this is a, another lovely bag. Mm. I love this color. Which yeah, um, that print. was another OG Stitchery, Tracy. Yeah, that's a great print. Know. This is a, I guess I kind of stopped saying I love this, but I haven't done anything <laughs> on it. But <laughs> probably won't recognize it from here. But this is uh, Owl Forest Embroidery, Borscht. And, mm. you know, the whole kit. Mm -hmm. um, yep. This is the first one. I don't I think I have a couple kit. of these. But I think it's the first one I actually did anything on. Mm. And like, yeah, those yeah, flosses. Yeah, the flosses. They are, are just gorgeous. Yeah. Yep. So I've had this for mm -hmm. a couple of years or more. And it's I all right. I have a couple I... of our forest embroidery kits that yeah. I haven't started. Um, so I, you know, this year, I think it will at least see the light of day at some point. Uh -huh. Oh, this is one that vexes me. <laughs> <laughs> Last Stitch Cemetery. Oh. Okay. You know, my friend, Tracy, mm -hmm. 
we had a sale, which I think you joined in on, right? Um, I was going to, but then I think, um, why didn't I? I can't remember why. I didn't. <laughs> because I you think saw, saw I... the misery that it was causing <laughs> us. So, you know, my friend Tracy, who, <laughs> yeah, you sure, said, she's made yeah, us you said loads that. of gorgeous yeah, you said that. bags and, <laughs> uh -huh. you know, um, mm -hmm. scissor mm -hmm. holes, loads of things. Mm -hmm. We were sailing, and I was actually in the lead for quite oh, a wow. while. Yeah. And then one day, yeah. you know, he happened to look on Instagram, and not only is she pulled ahead, she finished the thing. That? <laughs> <laughs> and that's where I am. So this is one. I don't know if I'll yeah. finish it this year, but I got to put some decent time into this. Yeah, yeah. This falls under the boss me category of a project that needs some love. Okay. All right. Yeah. Good. Well, you, you know, started maybe... the headstones. You know, I think you have all the, do you have Turns? all of the, um, actually all the lettering? Is all the lettering done? I do have all the lettering. You know, Great. I did make um, one or two little mistakes somewhere so that I'm, oh, I didn't drop anything up. Yeah. Um, somewhere in the, and it's like, you know, it's not going to be noticeable, but it's one of those things I always have to keep in mind. Mm -hmm. So I think that's why it just became a pain to me. But, mm -hmm. you know, you know. Yeah. <laughs> we all know how that goes. All right. I think we're back to the, um, well, back to another Tracy thing. Oh, this is yeah, really one cute. of my favorites. Yeah. I love Valentine's themed things. Mm -hmm. That's just gorgeous. Yeah. This is another one that Jane could rightfully shake her head about yes another mill hill and all the buttons and beads what's this camping, camping out. out look at that look I how know. cute that is and look at how much you've got done i know i once again it's really just pretty much the beads almost Ooh, i think yeah. i'm all, yeah 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 and i know i've said this times before it's like I have no interest in actually going camping, but there's something about this that makes it look really, really fun, fun and appealing. Yeah, you know? exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So. All right. So um, any thoughts on Mill Hill Monday? Will you, are you going to pull them all out and like the one that's closest to a finish? No, or? it's kind of, I mean, I, um, again, at the end, I'll have the one that I, I worked on last week. Mm -hmm. So it's sort of like whatever I was interested in, but okay. I'm going to stick with that one. Okay. I'm going to actually see one to completion, Jane. Okay. And then Love I'll it. go back and dig one of these others out. Mm -hmm. And I and when I go back, I mean that and pomegranate are definitely Top the on two the list. that I'm thinking of. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. This will be Mill Hill year. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what am I? Oh, yes, I'm up to a, wouldn't be me if there wasn't a prairie schooler in there. Mm. But this one's a little different for me. This one was my um, snow day project last year. And will it be this year? No. No? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I think you know, I usually do small quantities of prairie schooler and all those green trees. Mm. I don't know, all those red barns. Mm -hmm. I really got tired of it, but I I have a, a snow day project of mine this year. Christmas tree but it farm. has no it hasn't been available yet on I've been waiting on one, two, three. And it hasn't come. So, you know, we had that big snowstorm and I didn't have a snow day project. <laughs> so I guess I could have taken this out, but I kept working on something else. So if I don't get another one, I might come back to this. But So you started working oh, up the, up the left-hand side, huh? Um, no, this Looks is like the right-hand side, isn't it? Oh, I see. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, got it. <laughs> um... Yes, I started mm -hmm. coming down there. Nice. Okay. I don't know. All right. I don't know. All right. I want to get something on it this year. I'm not going to abandon it, <laughs> but, you know, it just isn't isn't speaking to me. Okay. Um, you know, I did 
when I was going on and on about what I didn't like about Last Stitch Cemetery, I should have added, though, I love that fa fabric. This coloring cotton Balmoral, mm. 32 count Belfast linen. Mm. And this is, oh, I love this too. It's 32 count lamb's wool jovelin. I love that. Yeah. Yeah. So maybe that'll draw me back to it, you know? Yeah. Another beautiful Just to feel it. Tracy bag. This is another beautiful um, Studio 88 West bag. That, oh, what? Oh. <laughs> Not I'm that sorry. Tracy's bags aren't I'm beautiful, sorry. but this, is, this happens to I'm be a sorry. Studio 88 West. <laughs> Because I have one too. I got, got stuck there. <laughs> okay, this is my summer pool project. <laughs> this is Hirschner's Always Thankful Coasters. And I've done another set of these. Um, they were slices of pie that I really loved. That was really fun. Um, and I found that these were very well for the pool mm -hmm. because it's on plastic canvas. Mm -hmm. Oops, looks like we have a little knot there, but if it gets wet, it's not a big deal. So <laughs> I didn't get real far in that, as you can see, but um, you know, summer will be coming someday, right? Exactly. And I'll get back to these. Did you fully finish those pie slices? I finished the stitching, yeah. but I haven't fully, fully finished, finished okay. it, yep. which is like, again, ridiculous, because all I need to do is, I can show oh, that, yeah. is cut those out, and, and it comes with these little tins, so, mm -hmm. again, yeah, no excuse. Can you find the tins? Yeah. Okay. Well, I, mean, I even know where both sets are. All right, well, then not. absolutely no excuse. Yeah, I know. <laughs> All right, next we've got, this is a Anna kit. Hmm. Um, I don't know how many years ago I bought this. And I believe it's called uh, Halloween Bunting. And cute. it is cute. Yeah, it is cute. But again, it's one of those things that kind of stopped calling to me. Mm -hmm. Um, I have like the eyes up here on the corner. Yeah. I don't expect this to be done this year, but I would like to have more than this done on it mm -hmm. by the end of the year. So they start sticky. in the middle. Yep. Yep. All right. So we got the lantern going. Yep. Okay. And this is, looks like That's a 14 funny. count. Yeah, Black. exactly. So it's not it too. Came with. It's not too bad. No, no, it isn't. It was more just lack of interest, you know. Uh huh. So we'll get something on that. All right. Thank you. All right. We're turning the page. Okay. Literally and figuratively. <laughs> oh, this is another one. Wait. Well, although Jane is kind of a reason I don't have this done. So I'm sure I'm sure you know what I'm talking about. Oh this is the faded uh -huh. in the air by Meridian Designs. By the way, do you have my chart? Because I can't <laughs> No, I have the one extra one you bought and gave to me. Oh, believe it or not, I can't find this chart again. And uh so you can't hold on to them. Then. No, I had it done, and then I I wanted to do my initials in the year in this darker um you know color on the on the bacon, and so I had to I had to uh, ask me I what had it to was. Talk to Chris and and find out what it was <laughs> what the color was because I can't I can't find my chart. I was just not to meant meant to have you. This you chart. really weren't, and it is a cute one. Yeah, and look, all I have to do on this was is finish that pig and mm -hmm. do like minimal back stitching yeah at various places yeah and this thing is done yeah so that is one of my 17 okay and this is on another fabric i love mm. 32 sorry for that bulge there but 32 should have taken that out of the q-snap but i know how hard it is so uh. yeah <laughs> 32 pound silver mist lugana by silk weaver 
Mm. This will be finished in no time. Yes, absolutely. Well, I'm, and then minute. you can stitch the bag. Yeah, yeah. Wait a minute. I want to see that charcoal bag. <laughs> the all right. All witnesses. <laughs> all witnesses. Okay. <laughs> well, I don't need the chart anymore, so... <laughs> That'll be uh, coming to says a, you. That'll be coming to a freebie table <laughs> near you, uh, if I can ever find it again. All right, this is one I've had. Not really sure why I haven't pulled it. I think it, I know. I think it scares me, but um, I mm. do love this. I'm yeah. known Stony Creek uh, Beach Bounty, yeah. and I love this fabric as well. This is. 32 count Smoky Pearl Wexford by Silk Readers. Mm. As you can see, not a lot to show. Mm -hmm. but, so, but started. But started. And this is one that's, you know, got its own boss me square and mm -hmm. balls in. I think it's the kind of thing that if I spend five days on it, yep. I bet I'd want to keep going. Yeah, probably. Could you could you fold that up for me, please? I'm, I'm trying. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> this next yeah, this one. This is nice fabric. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, no, why aren't you stitching on this? This is nice fabric. I know, I know. <laughs> it is perfect for that. Yeah. Um, this one kind of falls under the category of that camping out. Hmm. This is not my thing. Um, is Carriage House Samplings, Nature's Peace. I don't think I ever did anything by Carriage House Samplings before. Mm. Um, and, I, and I do like it, but again, it's, I don't know, Animals in the Forest, that's not my thing. <laughs> um, <laughs> but I bought it on some fabric. I, whoops, I think I lost a... Floss there. Yeah. Um, it's cute. Yeah, really I got cute. it on a fabric that I love. This is Linger, um, 28 Count Lugana by B Stitch Me. And that's what I got done. So this isn't nice. one of the 17 that I'm hoping for a finish on, mm -hmm. but I am hoping to. Get some a progress bit more, yeah. yeah. And it's not something that I think is terribly, no. you know. I mean, there's right. a lot of white, well, blank space on there, right? Yeah. Uh, a lot of blank space. There's some, yeah. You know, the animals are solid, but the yep. trees should go fast. Yeah. Thank you. And I too. Have a lovely bag by Tracy with the C on it. This was <laughs> my pool project from summer of twenty one. Okay, right? and that's this is before I discovered that pool stitching on plastic canvas might be the way What's to the go. What's the way to go? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. So, but I've always liked this little dimensions kit. Mm. Be the light. Mm -hmm. I guess I just haven't liked it enough to. <laughs> You're already a light. Oh, <laughs> thanks, Jane. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone says that. And yeah, I admit, I don't even know which way this goes at this point. <laughs> but that's what's done. <laughs> okay. Everything in the kit. Okay. So, you know get a little something done on this. I'm just gonna pull these out in All the right. Okay. Okay. All right. Uh, this one I love. And I love the spang for my friend Missy. Uh-huh. She knows how much I loved London. Mm-hmm. That's a great fabric. Yeah, it's beautiful. And I don't even think I took this one out. Oh, I know why. This is, this needs a little more explanation. Um, this is called All is Bright and is from Hirschner's Big Book of Christmas Craft, uh, Make It Merry edition. And I wrote the page down so I can 
upload a picture for you. And we both love this one. I Yeah, this is a really nice yeah. one. This is really cute. All is calm. I love this mm -hmm. again. Mm -hmm. Don't know why I didn't get it finished last year. But it's the year for this one. Woohoo! Yeah. I got a fair amount done. Yeah. And I love this fabric, which I hope I knew what it was. I, uh, maybe I don't anymore, unfortunately. I believe it's Be Stitch Me. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, I guess I, I don't know what that is anymore. Oh, yeah. So you already have Calm Outline. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, got the star started. Yeah, stars so. going. Yeah. Yeah. That would got be a good, some, some of, yeah, that would be a good, um, like, uh, Saturday stitch. Yes. Type thing. If right, you yeah. Do some filming. Could even outline the letters or, yeah. All right. Um, next, oh, yes. This is a twofer in here. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I was saying the other day when I was going through this, um, this is Sweet Wings uh, Studio, mm. Let Heaven and Nature Sing. And I was thinking, like, this is one of my 17 that I should definitely finish. Absolutely. And, you know, I was thinking, I don't know why. 69 I haven't... by 45. Yeah. Absolutely. I know. I was saying, like, I don't know why I haven't finished this. And then I pulled it out and I thought, oh, I think it's coming back to me now. I do love this fabric. It is 36 count. I'm going to say Circe. Is that how you'd say that? Yep. C E R S E I. Um, Circe. Yeah. It's. Um, 36 count linen by Fabrics by Stephanie. And given the dark color, this can be a little hard to work on. But um, I'm not going to let that get oh, in my way. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, the good news is if you finish this, look at all the fabric oh, I that know. you have for other projects. I know. <laughs> there you go. I do. It's beautiful. It is. It's really, and this is and really. And I think I looks, bought it for this. It really looks nice on Yeah, that. it does, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. So I just got to. Yep. You just got to. Buckle down and come through on this one. Yep. And I've got one other one in here. And <laughs> this is Good Marriage by Mary Englebright, who I used to love. Um, you still do. I just guess I still do. Um, by illuminating, illuminating, no, imaginating. That's what that's called. Um, I do, but I don't love all the back stitching mm. on Ada mm. of this sort of thing. Mm. But I had started this for my thirtieth wedding anniversary, and this year we'll be and married. Yeah. 33 years. Okay. So I have a fair I'm done. Uh, but, do. you know, there's still yeah. all this stuff. And I think um, one of the retreats you were working on the border. Oh, I bet I was. Yeah. 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 You have a lot done. So I have a lot done. Mm -hmm. um, then I kind of thought, oh, maybe I'll give it to... Um, my daughter and son-in-law, when they got married. Well, it would have been nice Filthy. if you would have had it for their first wedding anniversary. Yes, that's which is coming next up month, though. <laughs> so it'll be finished someday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Now where are we? Oh, we're on the last one in this group. Then I just have the current thing. Okay. Here's another one. Jane should just shake her head about. <laughs> And she will. I'm getting dizzy. <laughs> <laughs> this is Portuguese fish. Oh, yeah. Which Jane found this in a magazine, The World of Cross Stitching, mm -hmm. from March 18. And I previously only saw this sold as a kit. And I just love this. <laughs> yeah. I just love this. I just love it. Well, why don't you and just do it? I know, <laughs> and I don't know that I touched this at all last year. Yeah. This is... Oh, that's cute. 
Yeah, how yeah. much I've done. Oh, the, oh, that's pretty. And like, I am gonna get yeah. this finished this year. That's for sure. really pretty. Because I love it. Yep. Um, I mm -hmm. don't have the fabric written down, unfortunately, but I'm almost positive. This is either 28 or 32 count Lugana. It's going to be 32, in, I Okay, bet. Yep. I think so, mm -hmm. in platinum. Yeah. Love that fabric, too, on it. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. I might have to do this. I think you might. We should sell this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay. All That's right. that. Then um, I have three others that... I have been working on... Another studio lady at West Bank. Oh, yeah, that's good. For those of you playing at home. <laughs> um, I have three things that I've been working on since our last video. And this was um, a bookmark, which my daughter so brought me back from Scotland. Mm -hmm. to my Christmas stocking. And... I don't know where the needle went now, but anyway, I um, got quite a bit done on this. Yeah, really cute. Yeah, yeah. So I'll finish that one up shortly. Mm -hmm. And it's um, it's finished. It's finished, yeah. Right? They give so a little you... finishing instructions with it, although they actually don't show it on here. But it comes with a tassel, uh -huh. so you do kind of sew it up and put that on. And nice. I think I can handle that level. Mm -hmm. And oh, it has a backing on it. Uh huh. So I think I can handle that level of stitching. Very nice. Yeah, that's been fun. Um, that goes with it. Yeah. Yep. And speaking of Mill Bill Mondays. Mm -hmm. So last this is Monday. what you'll be working on today? I will. Okay. Last Monday, I off my Mill Bill collection, I pulled out Travel Time, which was speaking to me. Uh-huh. And... This is it. When I started, I think I just had the outline on um, this suitcase. Mm -hmm. And again, this has all the fill-in, too. So I started to do a bit of that. Yep. And this has been really fun. So I'm I on my Boss Me board, I had five days on a mill hill. So I've done that. Mm -hmm. And uh, again, I'm going to work on this again on Monday. Which and is I hope today. Yes, <laughs> I hope keep those up till yep. um, that's finished, beaded, framed, okay, etc. All right, that goes there. And last but not least, number twenty nine, no thirty, because I am. Oh yeah, that. you added yeah. the uh, bacon and eggs. Mm -hmm. Is um, Bobby Threads Country Cottage by Moira Blackburn. And mm. this is the one that I am definitely finishing in 24 for a gift. And I, I did get quite a bit done on that. You did, yeah. Yeah. You were working on this Saturday, weren't you? Yes, yeah. I was. You yeah. working on it Wednesday, too? Uh, okay. I might have done um, Mill Hill, I think, Wednesday. Okay. Yeah. So now I'm um, finishing up on well I'm not finishing exactly but there's like about three more colors of flowers in this border going mm -hmm. around so I'm kind of concentrating on that and as that color appears and other motifs that are still undone mm. I'm doing that. Did we show the picture? Yep. Oh, go on, but go ahead. <laughs> um, <laughs> sorry it's so coming I'm along. Sleeping over here. Okay. And that is in my, oops, I haven't got anything else tucked That's in That's in your there. Lillian bag. Yes. <laughs> and this is one I haven't been able to show in a while either, but this <laughs> lives here now. So we love these, Lillian. Phew, that's it. Wow, okay. Is anybody still watching? <laughs> <laughs> What's that pile? Um, I, that's, um, Paul, but I don't okay. think we're going to go into that this time. All right. Time. Okay. We can, we'll all right. save something all right, to we can, we can keep bringing people time. back for another time. <laughs> sure. <laughs> all right. That's great. That's great. So you're going to pull out a few that you think you can get a finish on this year. 
Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Good. And we're both doing Mill Hill Mondays. Yeah. So that's yeah. uh that's I may have a new start now and then, but mm. I'm gonna try to um, you know, really make the dent in yeah. As I say, if I got like even fifteen of those yeah. finished, yeah. I'd be well, I think just working on Mill Hill Mondays, like that's gonna you're yeah. gonna make some good project progress. Right. So yeah. Because there were a lot of mill hills in there. <laughs> <laughs> there, there are. And but some that haven't even been open yet. So. <laughs> but who can resist a mill hill? It's I so know, cute. I know. And it's so like blingy. And... When, uh, you know, we always talk about a Galleria at Silver Needle. They just have this mm. wall of mill hills. Some of them in the the on the perforated paper. Some of them on material. Yeah. And... Yeah, they just beautiful. get us every time. I just I love know. to go and stare at them. All. <laughs> I, I mean, like we always say, ones that wouldn't necessarily grab you, mm -hmm. and yeah, when, when you, you see, see them, them finished, done, yeah, 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 uh huh. Um, and uh, then they, dang them, they came, they come <laughs> out with series, you know. So then and you, you love a good series. I do love a good series. How many? Uh, so. Do you just have that one? Mill Hill series going, or are there? Yeah, yeah. Okay, I have a bunch of other Mill Hill kits, but yeah. um, that's that's the only series that I bought. Okay, but that's enough. Yeah, and they, I think they keep coming out with more in that series. I don't think they're done with that series. That town yet. is getting bigger and bigger, huh? Yeah, yeah. Someday, <laughs> God willing. So. There's a lot of Mondays, but in my future, I yeah. think so. <laughs> oh, hopefully the year works out. We maybe get, I don't know, would we get 53 of them this year? Yeah, or right, <laughs> right, yeah. Because <laughs> we need it. <laughs> uh huh, yeah. Yeah. So thank you all for um, sticking, with us. sticking with us. Um, thank you for um, any uh, new subscribers. Thank you very much. And. Of course, our old friends or our, uh, I guess I shouldn't say old, I should say long -term our long-term friends. friends. Uh, thank you for um, tuning in, and we will see you in a couple of weeks, right? We sure will. And Chris is going to have a lot more progress <laughs> toward working toward her finishes. <laughs> Hopefully I will too. All right. All right. Take care. Bye. Bye-bye.